Hello everyone, welcome to this week's Top 5 Tuesdays. Real quick, Stassi wants to say hi to you guys. Say hi Stas. Say hi mama baby. Hi! And then Daisy? Daisy wants to say hi too. Hi Daisy. Say hi. Alright, so this week, for those of you who are new to my channel, welcome. I know a lot of you guys are coming over from Michelle's channel, which is bomb. I mean, when she was gone in Japan, who else was having like serious FOMO on YouTube? Like, ugh, these videos are just kind of wah, wah, wah. I was so happy when she got back because I was like, ah, yes, finally, good content. <laughs> So welcome to my channel. Um, this is a series that I do with Michelle Wong, who is a really good friend of mine, and she's an amazing YouTuber, amazing influencer. And we go over our top five favorite products, depending on what topic we are going to be talking about that particular week. We've been doing this for over a year. We have over 50 videos of this. So we've been doing this for a while. But today, we couldn't narrow it down to top five. So we're like, all right, we're going to have to do a top 10. So we're doing top 10 Tuesdays and we're gonna do fall lips fall lips that we are currently using that are currently in our rotation everything from nudes to vampire shades so that you guys can kind of see the plethora of um, choices that we're gonna be giving you guys so keep in mind so Michelle has lighter skin tone than me and more of like a medium to tan skin tone depending on the season so if you have a similar skin tone to mine a lot of these shades might look good on you. If you have a lighter skin tone, you definitely want to check out Michelle's channel because she probably will be able to show you colors that look good on her. But she and I tend to like a lot of the same things, so just keep that in mind. Alright guys, if you're interested in seeing my top 10 current fall from nudes to vampy shades, then let's get on into it. Alright, so I'm not going to lip swatch all 10 of them because we would be here for a very long time and my lips would not be happy. And so we're not gonna do that. I am going to show you guys swatches of shades that I probably have not swatched or done a lip swatch video on before. Those that I have done lip swatch videos on before, I will let you know and I will link them down below in my description box. So just keep that in mind. But first up, let's start with what I have on my lips right now. This is very current, very on trend right now. This is from the Pillow Talk collection. This is by Charlotte Tilbury. So my first favorite is gonna be a combination. I am wearing the iconic Pillow Talk lip cheat. Then I have the Pillow Talk Matte Revolution lipstick on. And then I have the Pillow Talk new lip luster on top. And this is what it looks like on me. I do have a full video dedicated where I swatch all these three for you guys too, so I will link that down below. But I already have this one a combination on because that's what I've been loving lately. So I hope you like it as well because it's just so pretty. All right, so the next two are from Natasha Denona. They're more on the nudie side as well. The two that I've been really loving the most from the Natasha Denona I Need a Nude collection there's Michelle, our Michelle, and Claudia. Those are my two favorite. I will go ahead and swatch both of these for you. But I did a full dedicated video where I do lip swatches and everything, so I will link that down below for you guys so you guys can see what it looks like on me. And also, if you go to my Instagram, you'll see pictures of me wearing them as well. Okay, so this one is Michelle. This one is... Claudia. I love this particular formula. It is just so nice. Feels so comfortable on the lips. They glide right on. They're really, really pretty. And they're beautiful nude colors. And they're easy to wear. And they're perfect for me right now. And I've been loving them. And I'm going to continue wearing them throughout the season. So this was a hard topic to narrow it down to. Because we were just going to do fall lips. And then it just kind of spiraled it snowballed into something much bigger and then we were like alright let's just do top 10 and the way that I kind of picked my top 10 was I was like alright what do I have in my purse that's what I did and there is more in my purse and in my um, backpack that, that's where I kind of chose things because I was like alright these are the things that I'm right now personally using personally grabbing gonna be using for the next couple months yeah I am a lipstick whore. I love lipstick. Alright, let's get into the next shade. Alright, the next two lipsticks that I'm currently loving are from Chanel and these are the Rouge Coco Flash um, formula. 
So there's two shades. One is number 66 Pulse and number 208 Lumiere. So I will swatch these for you guys and then do lip swatches for you as well. So here's Lumiere, here's Pulse. So this formula is more on the sheer side, but it's very comfortable. They look really pretty on the lips and make your lips look really juicy. So it's kind of like a lip balm, lipstick type of combination. So let me show you guys the first color. So this is number 208 Lumiere. I love this particular color. It has a really pretty pinky peachy tone to it and it makes your lips look more plump. They're hydrated. It feels very nice on the lips and it's just a very, very pretty color. All right, let's check out the next one. So this is the shade Pulse. It's a really beautiful orangey red, but it's not too orange. There's a lot of red in it, which I appreciate and it gives you like that really beautiful pop of color. It's very vibrant, formula is great, and I love it. All right guys, don't get mad at me for picking this next shade because it's currently not available, but I believe it is going to be restocked later on this year, especially I think before the holidays. This is the Lisa Eldridge Velvet Matte Lipstick in, or the Velvet, yeah, I think they're called the Velvet Mattes. This is in Velvet Jazz. I'll show you a swatch of it. So it's more of that dark, vampy kind of red. It's so beautiful, and I really like this formula a lot. I apologize if the application is a little wonky. You do need a lip liner when you apply this, but look how beautiful of a color it is. And look at the actual lipstick. It literally looks like velvet. So gorgeous and so perfect for the fall time. And it's such a pretty, pretty red, brick red, vampy type of shape. All right, the next shade is by Charlotte Tilbury. This is part of the Hot Lips 2 collection. I'm not gonna do a lip swatch of it because I did a whole video dedicated to it. So I will link that down below for you as well. But I will show you a swatch. This is Viva La Vergara. Such a beautiful color. So that's Viva La Vergara right there. Really like it, love this particular formula. The packaging is just gorgeous. And the, you know, the velvet, I mean, the uh, Matte Revolution lipsticks by Charlotte Tilbury are just amazing. I mean, what else can I say? And this particular shade, it looks so pretty. Kind of like a more of a darker nude on those of you who are my skin tone or deeper. So I think you would really appreciate this. Really nice color. And then next up, this one I will lip swatch for you. This is by Pat McGrath. This is in the shade Guinevere. I have it in this like limited edition packaging, but it is part of her permanent um, collection. So. Let me show you a swatch of it. And this is also one of those darker, vampy shades right there. And this is part of the matte trans formula. And it's a really good matte lipstick as well. Comfortable formula. All right, again, sorry about the uh, wonky application, but isn't this such a beautiful color too? I mean, you guys can kind of see a theme. I like really nudes, and then I like these like vampy shades that are these like dark reddish, brick, maroonish type of shades that just scream fall time. So beautiful, love this particular formula. This color is just so cute. Pretty, and I love that it's called Guinevere. I don't know why, but I think it's just very appropriate for the shade. All right, next up is my like kind of go-to red. Like I'm talking about a true red. This is the Charlotte Tilbury Matte Revolution lipstick in red carpet red, which I think is like literally one of my favorite red lipsticks.
So it's like that true t blue toned type of red. Really, really beautiful. I will put this on for you. Just because I like it that much. <laughs> Definitely need a lip liner when you're applying this but look how beautiful it is isn't that just so incredibly beautiful I love this red shade like when I want to just kind of have a little pick-me-up or I just want to take my look from zero to a hundred this is what you do you put on a sexy red and you rock it <laughs> so yeah this is my my favorite go-to red true red lip shade all right, thank God we are down to number 10. Okay, so this combo is new to my collection and I haven't um, hauled it, or I actually did an unboxing for it. This is the um, a lip combination from House Laboratories, Lady Gaga's new makeup line, but I haven't done like a video where I actually um, show you guys what the makeup looks like on me. So this combination is her R.I.P. Lip Liner in Rule. It's a Demi, um, Demi Matte Lip Liner. Let me swatch it for you. And then the lip gloss that goes on top of it is called um, Venus. And it really makes your lips look super plump and big, which I love. I mean, who doesn't? Okay, so there is the lip liner. And there is the lip gloss and the lip liner the lip gloss is all right it's not anything that's like oh my god amazing but with the lip liner it looks so good and I really like her lip liners a lot I think I want to get more of her lip liners they're really creamy And sometimes I just literally just wear the lip liner because I think it's just such a pretty color and I put some lip balm on top and it's good to go. Look how pretty that color is, right? Okay, so let's now put the lip gloss on top. Like, look how plump. I mean, granted, my lips are swollen right now because I've been up <laughs> taking off, putting on lipsticks, but it really does plump up your lips and it looks really, really nice. So this is Venus and Rule by Lady Gaga House of Laboratories. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed this top 10 Tuesdays that Michelle and I are presenting to you from nudes to vampy lips. I hope you found some colors that maybe are new to you and maybe you want to try out. When you're done watching my video, head on over to Michelle's channel. I will link her channel and her video down in the description box. If you guys came from Michelle's channel, welcome. Enjoy this video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and hit that bell notification button. And I hope you guys enjoy this video and I will see you all very soon. Thanks. Bye.